You've created a custom room. Your room is invite only until you decide to publish it. You can name and publish this room by pressing this room on your watch. So let's say you you have a cube, but you want this cube to be well be affected by physics. So you go ahead and do that. But there's a new problem now. You can just walk right. No, oh, hold on. You, you, you can just walk right through, it, and if you try and stand on it, you fall through. So most people, so I think mo most people don't actually know the solution to this problem. But the actual solution is again animation gizmo. Wire this up, and that's literally all you have to do. And now it's a physical object. You know you can walk on it, but you can still move it around with your hands. And then, if you set this to be grabbable, you can pick it up and throw it around. Boom. It's good if you, if you want to make games where, where you have to build bases, and you want it to, so everything is affected by gravity. Right? We have to hook all of these up to the animation gizmo. No, so... Something that makes it quick, just select everything, wire one thing, over here, boom, everything's in the animation. So that's pretty simple. Oh, oh, oh. Also, if you're making rag dolls, um... Oh. Yeah, so if you're making rag dolls, uh... <laughs> These are actually affected by like by like uh, guns and stuff. So if you're making rag dolls, kind kind of a good option. So basically, what <laughs> what this does is it makes it so. So if you want to build a base, you sort of got to build it like this. Oh. Well. Oh. Well, well, normally you wouldn't want to destroy it, but, but basically all objects have physics, but you can interact with them, which means everything you supports. So, that's a quick berry tip. <laughs>